Hey everybody, this is Nick from the Arcade Hunters welcoming you back to 880 Jupiter Park Drive here in Jupiter Park, Florida. And we are checking out from 1992. This is Gottlieb Super Mario Brothers. Now if you saw the uh, previous video that I shot of the Super Mario Brothers Mushroom World, as I said, this was one of the two games that they made um, from Gottlieb with the uh, Nintendo characters on it. They were going to make a Zelda game, but unfortunately that did not uh, come to fruition and it ended up becoming a game called Gladiators. So this was the first one that came out, and I, I yeah, I'm pretty sure the, the, the large one came out first and then Mushroom World. So I'll be uploading the Mushroom World uh, video first. But this game supposedly is the very first time that Charles Martinet ever played Mario. In a, in a game before, and this they said it, uh, a couple of uh, websites that I read said that it was before um, he did the um, the educational, like Mario Teaches Typing series, so. Very simple layout of the game. Uh, one of the things that, um, since I, I only work here Saturdays at the Pinball Dudes, uh, one of the things that um, they have to put in is, um, if you ever see some of the um, other Stern games they have, um, lights uh, along the back. Um, those lights are out, but they're going to put those back in, and um, that's just one of the things I want to mention uh, before they, probably by the time I come here next week, um, this game won't be here because they constantly move games in and out, and I wanted to get a video of this since I had the video of Mushroom World, and I have not gotten a chance to get a video of the original one, so unfortunately, it is a very simple game. Um, you can abuse the game a lot because all you have to do is there's an auto launcher right here. You auto launch the ball right up here where it's uh, Mario on Yoshi. And pretty much all you got to do is keep shooting the ramp over and over again, using the left flipper and going up and you slowly spell out the word super. And every time you spell super, if you shoot right there into that little um, saucer, into this hole right here, unfortunately the light is on above us, um, you'll shoot into that castle and you'll kill one of the castles. And you pretty much have to do that seven times. Spell out super, hit the castle, and that's how you progress through the game. And, you know, Mario will say, I'm super now! And the um, this drop target pops up so you get a bit of a ball save on there, there's a quick two ball multi ball, there's a couple of other little modes, but you know, fortunately not that much to do. It It's very funny considering that Adam's Family came out a year before, pretty much the same year, because this was, uh, the copyright on that is 91 and this is 92, but you know, how much they were making um, Adam's Family, there was a couple, you know, like over 10,000 units of this and only 4,000 of this one. And I don't think they make a um, color DMD for the um, for the Gottliebs. There is a little bit of um, some display issues on that, but uh, other than that, the game is working pretty good. You can hear Back to the Future over there. Now, uh, because of the um, the lighting on it, I'm going to keep the lights on for the purpose of the video, just because I really want to get a video of both Mario Brothers machines. So, I'm going to set the tripod up, and we are going to play the game Super Mario Brothers: The Pinball Machine here at the Pinball Dudes. Let's go check it out. Yeah, and also, even though they're using Super Mario World stuff, it's weird that they got Wart on there for uh, level 6 and they have Luigi captured. I don't even think you get to, you don't even get to play as Luigi in the game, but let's go set up the tripod and we're going to play Mario Brothers. Yes, I said Mario. Ooh, come get me. Yeah, I don't think we got the say no to drugs <laughs> message. But yes, let's go start up the game. Super Mario Brothers, uh, the volume is a little bit low, so hopefully you can hear it okay. So let's go. There he is. Very first time. Oh yeah, that's definitely him. Oh, 
right down the toilet. I should have checked it. I don't think there's a. Uh, You'd hear that all through the arcade with him going. Now I want multi ball. Let's get uh, the. You got the bumpers with the multi ball. Or just drain right down there and it doesn't give you a save. Bumpers. Yeah, it's felt super. Yeah, we could play it like you're supposed to, or we could just go for tons of points. Got a nice kickback on there. And he starts singing. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> I thought it was going to bounce. And of course there's a... Uh, both of the scoop shots will advance your super anyway, so... Roll the roulette. And now it spells out super. Really cool, the uh, little castle does spins on there. Get up there. Come on. Get up there. You gotta get through those pop bumpers to get to the castle. You're not. You're never in the castle. You're only in the last castle. Ooh. And we lost, so it is time. They don't show you the time. Go figure. So now we gotta spell out super all over again. So I get in there to get the jackpot. And yes, that is the game. <laughs> A couple extra moves that you can do, but it's got a little shaker in it. You can feel it once you uh, knock down the castle. And I said it before, still one of my favorite Gottlieb games that they ever made in this era. Definitely had to be. Ooh, we got a free game. We got the Yoshi Countdown. I'd rather get a castle. And I got the couch. Nope. Right down the toilet. Like they got a little, uh... I thought that was... You brought us so much joy to this old Italian stereotype. Uh, this is my voice is any better. Okay, let's go. We have a good time. Hey, he doesn't say let's go. It's weird. It's weird here to not say that for so many years. Then again, I'm so old. For me, the voice of Mario will always be the um, Captain Lou Albano from the old Super Show. I could tell he was having a lot of fun when he was doing that. Or it might have just been all the drugs that he was on. Maybe a little column A, a little column B. It was Captain Lou. Captain Lou was insane. <laughs> See, ah, oh, we almost got it. Well, 
more and we got a chance to kill the castle. I'm a super now. Bounce. Double Yoshi bonus. Don't really care about that. I gotta kill the castle. Ooh, I lost it already. Wow, that was quick. Oh, it's a matter for me. Yeah, some of the other weird things. I don't know if it was Charles Martinet that did it or somebody else did it. I forget. He did it like a. He did it at uh, basketball games where it was like the thing with Wario. Castle extra ball. Right, let's get an extra ball. Or we'll just rain right down because I wasn't expecting to bounce like that. Do one more time. We get more Mario on pinball. More Mario pinball. I've seen other people have that had um, put a lot of add-ons. They put like all the different Mario toys on this game. doesn't look right since they're using like current day Mario with like the old Mario World Mario. It's yeah he just does Mario. There's, there's no Luigi unfortunately. Not yet. This was definitely before uh, in the time of all Luigi so no wah. No wah for you. I know the kids out there, they love their memes, they love their wall -yard. Maybe we'll get our wall Ouija and Smash Brothers. I doubt it. Or I'll just... And then he sings and makes fun. Yes, that was terrible. I want an act actual game. That was awful. Come on. Two chairs. No! The hell is that? Yeah, I agree. That was terrible. I got my U. Rubber bands all over this game. Really nice. So I get to advance my super attitude ball multi ball. I'll take that. Get back to the future over there. Nothing! Zilch! Goose eggs! Nothing! Not a zip. Pretty sure that's in, um. The other golf game we got does. Our multi balls lit, but we have our castle lit too. So I get the castle. I'm taking post transfer on this one. Good, we got multi ball. Multi ball. Here we go. And we got the castle. Jackpot collected. Oh yeah, here's the other thing. So, like a lot of um, Gottlieb's games that they had, it's a, project it's a progressive jackpot. So, I was playing it before when, uh, when we tested it, so I killed two other castles. So, I don't know if it's, is this going up on there? You can see on here where it says castles completed. So, there's three castles completed. It doesn't start at one and go up to seven so you can walk up to this there'll be six castles completed and it's not any harder and you just pretty much hit the seventh castle and you get a ton of points more than I would have gotten with the third one so that's another reason why 
They one time they used this in the tournament. They actually used it up at the Pinball Wizard Arcade from uh, Pelham, New Hampshire. If you saw a video of that, and once they found that out, they're like, "Yeah, uh, we're not gonna be able to play Mario Brothers anymore because no one had ever played it in a tournament before because it's one that you don't see often." So. Hopefully, guys, you had enjoyed that video. You got to see a little bit of what the game has to offer. So, once again, I am Nick from the Arcade Hunters. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to check us out here at the Pinball Dudes at 880 Jupiter Park Drive here in Jupiter Park, Florida. So, guys, take care and have a good one.